This is the Chemistry for Biology channel. I'm John Irwin. Our topic today is create and download a subset of small molecules from zinc. You can find this video and other ones like it on our YouTube channel, or you can like us on Facebook and you can follow us on Twitter. This work was supported by the NIH. And um, this work comes to you from the University of California, San Francisco Department of Pharmaceutical Chemistry. So we're going to create a subset of molecules from zinc and download it for docking. So here we are on zinc.docking.org in any browser. And first, let me remind you that we have a lot of statically prepared subsets in zinc. The uh, lead-like, fragment-like, drug-like subsets of various kinds are all ready to go, and so you don't need to search the database for these molecules uh, to download them. You can simply download them, and that's why we have them there. Similarly, for each vendor, we have many, many subsets that you can simply download. So please, don't just create subsets of vendors because they're already ready to go, and that'll be covered in a separate video. But if you want to create an arbitrary small set of molecules using arbitrary criteria, you can do it and then download it. This feature didn't really work very well in, in Zinc 11, the old version. So I'm going to show you how to do it with the new version. You go to uh, Search Properties. Imagine we want to download things that are sort of like uh, fragment-like. But in addition, we're going to specify that the polar surface area must be at least 40, but must be no more than 80. Okay. And similarly, the molecular weight, uh, we want to have a narrow range. Who knows why? but we're going to have a, a narrow range of from 200 to 250, and that's going to be our uh, range, okay? And similarly for log P, minus 4 is too much. We actually want only molecules between uh, 1 and uh, 2.5, okay? And similarly, net charge, uh, we're going to, we want to say, oh, actually we're going to only have molecules that are neutral. Fine. So arbitrary criteria, run query, count to 10, not even 10, you start to get some molecules. Terrific. So, if you want to download them in MOL2, you go like that. If you want them in SMILES, you want go like that. If you want them in SDF, you go like that. So, today we're going to do MOL2. Second choice is representation. Do you want a single representation at pH 7? Do you want all the representations between 6 and 8? Do you want high pH, low pH, and so on? So, we're going to pick uh, default, which is the same as usual in this case. And the second of all, th the last thing is, is how long are you willing to wait to buy them? Purchasable could mean quite a while. If you want it to be guaranteed in two weeks or high probability in two weeks, pick in stock only. And now you go refresh and then you count to 10. No, you don't. You count to three. And then you see down in the lower right hand, cor left hand corner here, the uh, multi file starts downloading. Okay. And uh, while that's downloading, I'm going to uh, bring up uh, PyMol because we're going to look at the molecules once they've downloaded. So, okay, so here we go. Show in file. There's our zinc results. We drop them into there. And now you can simply sh go through and see that it's downloaded a lot of molecules. And they're all in MOL2 format. So they're all in their three dimensional uh, structures. They're biologically relevant forms. They're protonated. They should be, uh, in this case, neutral, just like we said, and you can buy them within two weeks. Terrific. And similarly, you can do searches by uh, with other criteria. So our topic today was create and download a subset of small molecules. Uh, thank you for paying attention. Uh, we're going to try and make more videos like this, and uh, please come back and see us again.